Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Serge. And I'm Cern. And we're going to finish up our session here by looking at the heart mm -hmm. of our cat. So we're going to do our cardiac point of care ultrasound evaluation. We're going to assess our uh, heart predominantly off the right parasternal site in short axis. That's right. Now compared to dogs, looking at the heart in cats can be a little tricky. You essentially want to put the probe in the right orientation right at that the xiphoid region. Um, and at that point, once you're there, you're just essentially going to angle the probe. That's it. That's all. There's not much sweeping to do. Yeah. So they have a very, very small uh, cardiac window uh, in our feline patients. But here you can see I got the aorta and the left atrium. You can see that in our image here now. And if I wish to fan down a little bit, you get the uh, fish mouth. And you go down a little bit further than that, you'll get the mushroom. So this is our cardiac evaluation yeah. uh, going uh, from LAO, like you see here, fish mouth. Yep. So right off the sternum, you can see there, that's all we're doing is right off the sternum, we put the probe there, correct orientation, 45 degree angle to the body, marker towards the elbow, and there we go. We get the fish mouth there. We get the mushroom, not really seeing the fish, we're going right to LAO. And that's the thing about cats. Most of the time, as soon as you see the heart, you fan, and you should get your LAO. There's my aorta. You can see a bit of the valve coming Beautiful. in. There's my left atrium there. I'll come down just a little bit. That'll give us the fish mouth. Oh, once you, there we go. Fish mouth. Blah, 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 blah. And down to the uh, mushroom. So there's our mushroom. There's our fish mouth. Blah, 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 blah. And we'll go a little bit more. There's our AO with the uh, valve Mercedes. coming in. Mercedes. So nice. that's our Mercedes and our uh, whale. That's our left uh, atrium and aorta, as you can see here. Once you get that, you can come back down to the mushroom. Really uh, more challenging to do for sure, though. You can go after that uh, four chamber four chamber view, uh, and we'll see if she's rotate ninety degrees. Doesn't matter which direction. There we go. We've got our right peristernal. Uh, we've got the there we go four chamber. You can see the left yep. atrium, right atrium. You can see the right ventricle and the left ventricle. So that's a quick view of our uh, four chamber. You nice. can see the. Uh, and if I go back this way a little bit, you can see the pulmonary vein coming in. And you can actually see the pulmonary artery just coming off the right atrium there. But that is our work chamber view. Yeah, and if we come back to mushroom, we can ask ourselves, is there pericardial effusion? Yes or no as well to site. Good site to look for this. And we can see there's no pericardial effusion. You just make sure you go from mushroom up to my fish mouth like you see here and then to the LAO when you do that. So you make sure you know your chambers and can differentiate them uh, from uh, pericardial effusion. Mm -hmm. And on that note, that's our quick view of the heart. Uh, we thank Daisy for her participation today. She's the perfect model. Uh, very social, very talkative, but uh, an excellent cat to scan. So Super cat. Thank you very much uh, for joining us. Uh, we hope we've uh, answered most of the questions or shown you what you can do with point of care ultrasound in our feline patients. That's right. And on that, merci beaucoup. Until next time.